Up Close Look is a special product presentation from Teacher Created Materials Publishing, featuring resources created by teachers for teachers and students. Hello, I'm Rochelle Cracchiolo, and as a former classroom teacher, I understand the challenges that you face in your classroom every day. That's why I am so excited to share with you some of our award-winning products. I know that once you have used our excellent resources in your classroom, you will understand our passion for teaching and our commitment to helping teachers help students learn. Hi, I'm Katie, your guide for an up-close look at exploring math and how it can work for you in your classroom. Exploring Math is a comprehensive intervention and reinforcement resource that is easy to implement and flexible enough for summer school, after school, or to support a year-long mathematics curriculum. Exploring Math moves beyond worksheets and drills to help students master and apply mathematics content while building important conceptual skills. Exploring Math provides targeted instruction with differentiated activities while focusing equally on basic math skills and higher level problem solving strategies. Based on the latest research and standards, exploring math lessons include innovative approaches to teaching mathematical concepts. Let's take a look at how exploring math works. By using the diagnostic tests, teachers can pinpoint students' areas of need. These tests provide you with an overview of a student's overall performance, which in turn helps you to prioritize the units and skills that need reinforcement in essence, gives you a starting point. You can begin to develop a plan that incorporates the tools needed to match your students' needs. Teacher tools include the teacher's guide, lesson units, problem-solving cards, and the fun cross-curricular skill application games. The teacher's guide includes program management information, detailed background for each of the problem-solving strategies, and identifies specific learning objectives used in each of the lessons. The easy-to-use lessons are featured in standalone units. Units vary by grade level to deliver appropriate content. Each of the lessons includes a short pre- and post-test, warm-up activities, and differentiated activities. And best of all, these concise, ready-to-use lessons require minimal prep time. Additionally, all unit lessons are featured as a slideshow presentation. As you know, problem solving is a critical 21st century skill that all students need in order to perform well on most standardized tests. Exploring math includes multiple opportunities for problem solving in each unit. Each problem solving lesson is supported by a problem solving strategy card and a real life problem solving card. Let's take a closer look at the problem solving strategy cards. Side A models how to teach the problem solving strategy. Side B provides a sample problem to complete individually or as a whole class. The real-life problem-solving cards are high-interest, engaging cards that feature real-life scenarios and require students to use a specific strategy to find a solution. These fun cards are designed to grab students' attention while at the same time teach and apply problem-solving skills. Problems are presented at three differentiated levels. Problems can be assigned according to level or choose one problem to assign to all. Let's peek inside this classroom and watch as the teacher and students discuss one of the real-life problem-solving cards and begin to explore one of the math strategies. Today we're going to solve problems to figure out how to share 12 brownies. We're going to look at the what is the problem on the back of this card. The first part of the problem-solving process is understanding the problem. So we need to figure out what we need to remember in order to solve the problem. She instructs her students to read the recipe with a partner and together discuss how many brownies the recipe makes and whether that quantity is enough brownies to feed the class. So we just learned about the math lesson and now we have to make brownies for the whole class. Yeah. So how many kids do we have in our class? Next, as students are asked to turn the cards over, they begin solving problems to help them figure out how to share 12 brownies. Okay, so why don't we flip the card over yeah. and see how we can solve this. So the problem, you help your mom bake a batch of brownies. Your mom cuts the brownies into 12 pieces. You want to take them to school and share them with your friends. Use the information above and in the problems below to answer the questions. You will be asked to work on one of the problems below. Before you begin solving the problem, be sure to locate the information you will need. Think about what con concrete materials you will use to help you solve the problem. Beginning with reading what is the problem on the back of the card, they will discuss what they know about the problem 
and important information to remember. To solve this problem, we're going to do something called acting it out. When we act something out in mathematics, we can use color tiles like these to represent brownies. Okay, problem B says you want to give each friend three brownies, and we already used the 12 brownies. With how many friends can you share your brownies? Okay, so I think we should break as much as we have as the tiles because it equals 12 all together. Let's break them into threes to see how much friends we get. Okay, so I have Okay, so say these are brownies. I have six brownies. I can make out two friends out of all the ones I have. And I can make out two friends. Another fun and engaging way to perk up students' interest is playing games. Exploring math includes skill application game boards that are colorful, easy to follow, and reinforce the skills and strategies explored in the lessons. These activities provide independent or small group practice to reinforce the math skills learned and connect to other content areas. Reproducible pages and student directions are featured on the back of the game board and are also included on the teacher resource CD. I hope you enjoyed this brief introduction to exploring math and have a better understanding of its benefits. For more information about this resource, please contact your area representative or call one of our customer support specialists. We'd be happy to help you explore how this and other resources like targeted mathematics intervention can help you meet your instructional goals. Be sure to download sample pages for this resource and other high-quality, award-winning products from our website.